Hello everyone, my name is Jennifer Oluolu, I'm from Nigeria, I'm a fourth year nursing student of the University of Port Harcourt and I'm a WMI scholar. Today on the mental health series, I'm glad to be talking to us on the benefits of diet to our mental health. As the awareness continues to increase on how best we can maintain and improve on our mental health, it is good that we know what diet can do to our mental health. Eating good food is good to our health and definitely eating taking in the wrong diet will definitely mar our health and so it is for mental health mental health specialists have found that that persons who consume more of processed food are more likely to fall into depression than those who don't therefore it is good that we watch out for the kind of food that we take in if we are really keen on improving on our mental health Neuropsychiatrists and nutritional psychiatrists have also observed that mentally ill patients who are managed with a certain form of diet that they call brain food tend to do better and are more or less to are less prone to fall into depression than do, or, or relapse than those who are managed with the regular psychotherapy and psychiatric drugs. So it is good that we know what these brain foods are and try to include more of them in our diet if we really want to maintain an optimal mental health. These brain foods include foods rich in omega-3 like oily fishes that can supply our body with enough omega-3. Omega-3 has been found to be very good in improving memory, thinking and our mood. Also, consuming whole grains, whole grains like beans. These have been found to supply or provide the body with a steadier supply of energy that has increased attention span. It is good that we include a lot of fruits and veggies in our diet because it helps to improve the gut health. And when the gut is good, the brain is good. How about snacking on nuts instead of our regular snacks? Snacking on nuts will make us feel better. And then dark chocolate. Dark chocolates are known to increase the level of flavonoids in our body and flavonoids improve blood flow to the brain. I believe if we put in these little tips into our diet, we'll be able to not only maintain a good mental health, but also get better from deranged or derailing mental health. Thank you very much for watching today's episode. Look out for our next video. Goodbye.